Hi, in this video I discuss the role of modifiers in universal dependencies. Modifiers are the third type of phrasal unit in universal dependencies which are used to refine the meaning of both nominals and clauses. Let's begin with nominals and define an example string with the text a very nasty comment and feed it to the language model that we stored under the variable NLP in the previous videos. We store the resulting spacey doc object under the variable modifier underscore n and call the render function from the displacey submodule of spacey to visualize the syntactic dependencies. This gives us a visualization of the syntactic dependencies in this nominal. As you can see, the head noun comment has an adjectival modifier, the adjective nasty, which in turn has an adverbial modifier in the form of the adverb very. Both of these modifiers serve to refine the meaning of the head noun comment. Just as we saw in the previous video for the conjunct relation, these relations, the adverbial and adjectival modifiers, can be applied to both clauses and nominals. Let's define another example with the clause the door opened slowly and feed it to the language model and store the resulting doc object under the variable modifier underscore c. We can then call the render function from the displacey submodule to visualize the syntactic dependencies in the resulting spacey doc object. In this case we can see that the head verb of the clause opened has a dependent in the form of an adverb slowly. And as you can see, the same relation, that is, adverbial modifier, is used to describe the relationship between the head verb and the adverb. Finally, clauses can also be modified by clauses, as exemplified, for example, by adverbial clause modifiers. In the next example, the door opened slowly without making a sound, which has two clauses, we can see an arc leading from the head verb opened to the verb making, which has the relation adverbial clause modifier. This illustrates how modifiers can refine the meaning of different phrasal units defined in the universal dependencies framework from nominals to clauses and their combinations. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about modifiers in universal dependencies, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks.